I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Good morning, Seminole Junior High, and welcome back to Pow Wow News. Reporting the news so you don't have to. Athletics and buses. Athletes, when riding to and from events, be sure to clean up your bus before you exit. Clean up even if it is not your mess. Word of the day, aglet, the plastic end of a shoelace. The aglet, which is typically plastic, was invented in 1790 by Harvey Kennedy. <laughs> Open your iPad to see if it's charging. You don't want the iPad to die on you tomorrow. And if it is not charging, plug out the cord and turn it into a teacher. Oh, it's not charging. I'm going to go I'll stay there for 50 years, manual. iPads. Tips and tricks for iPad help. Charge iPad open and make sure you see the green color with a lightning bolt. Update your iPad at the end of the day. If you charged it and it still says low percent, turn it off and back on. Valentine's Suckers and Singing Valentines will be on sale during lunch periods only. They are one dollar each. They will be on sale February 11th through February 14th. What do you think of the behavior students are showing this year? You know, what I've noticed about this year is all of the students seem pretty positive. Um, everybody is doing the right thing, and um, I've seen a lot of students show a lot of um, caring towards other students this year, which I didn't necessarily see last year. And so I think that the behavior this year has been exceptional. Thank you. What do you think of the behavior students are showing this year? Now, I've been really, really proud of our students this year and kind of what they've, I guess the ownership and the uh, maturity that they've shown. There's a lot, of, a lot of really good things going on this year. Students are starting to understand what some of the expectations that we have are. Um, I think a lot of, uh, one of the other big issues is they're starting to hold each other accountable and they're trying to find ways to be better as a class. And, it's just been overall, it's been better. I think we had, uh, when we looked at last year from the beginning of school to Christmas, and then this year from the beginning of school to Christmas, we had close to, uh, I want to say 1,300 less incidents, which usually there's a lot of incidents throughout the year, but that's quite a bit different. So I'm, I'm really proud of our students. We have great kids here in Seminole, and uh, man, I'm just thankful to get that I get to be here and, and see you guys every day. Thank you. You're welcome. Just because January. National Compliment Day comes around every year on January 24th. On this day, take the time to give someone a genuine, pure-hearted compliment. It just might make their day. Fun fact of the day. North Korea and Cuba are the only places where you can't buy Coca-Cola. Etiquette is the customary code of polite behavior in society or among members of particular profession or group. Some of these things are covering your mouth when you yawn, taking your hat off while indoors, saying bless you when someone sneezes, saying hello when you pick up the phone, shaking hands, keeping your elbows off the table. Sports recap. Maidens basketball. Eighth grade A team 165 to 8. Eighth grade B team 116 to 14. 7th grade A team won 31 to 12. 7th grade B team lost 27 to 28. Men's basketball. 8th grade A team won 74 to 28. 8th grade B team lost by 2. 7th grade A team won 30 to 17. 7th grade B team won 21 to 8. Sports recap. Indians basketball. Horse Stockton. Everyone won. Indians basketball. Monahans. 8th grade A team won 66 to 57. 8th grade B team won. 7th grade A team won 44 to 39. 7th grade B team won 57 to 11. Boys 8th grade A team won 53 to 37. 
B team won 44 to 22. Seventh grade A team won 47 to 25. B team won 42 to 22. Eighth grade girls A team won 71 to 14. Tournaments. Eighth grade A won two games and lost one. Seventh grade boys A won their tournament. Eighth grade A team girls won their tournament. Seventh grade A team girls placed third in their tournament. Um, what do you think you're saying? I think my spirit animal would probably be a wolf because I've always liked huskies and huskies are you know, uh, relatives of wolves. Uh, I've always been that wolf type of alpha male uh, leader, you know, uh, I'm that way with my family, with my students. If you had one elective, would you choose IT? If so, why? I would choose IT because I grew up with, my dad was not a woodworker, but he was an artist. So I love art too, um, but I would choose IT because I like to work with math and I like to work with something that I can build. Um, so that's, that's important to me, that's why I like it. I think it's very practical and I get to make something that I can use and that looks cool. And most of the time other, other people enjoy that, like as gifts or things like that. So that's, that's why I would choose IT and why. There's a town in New Mexico named Pie Town. What is your favorite type of pie? Um, probably cherry. My favorite pie is Oreo pie. What's your favorite type of pie? Cherry pie. <laughs> the pie would be strawberry pie. The first pie recipe was published by the Romans and was for a rye crusted goat cheese and honey pie. What is your favorite type of pie? <laughs> apple pie. My favorite pie is lemon. My favorite pie is apple pie. My favorite pie is apple pie. My favorite pie is banana pie. My favorite pie is pumpkin pie. My favorite pie is pecan pie. My what is your favorite pie, pie is pie probably pumpkin pie. pie. My favorite pie is either blackberry pie or pumpkin pie. What is your favorite type of pie? <laughs> I don't like pie. What is your favorite type of pie? Jerry. <laughs> what is your favorite type of pie? My favorite type of pie is either going to be apple pie or pumpkin pie. Okay. What is your favorite type of pie? Hamburger pie. Pie is apple pie. Pie results. SJHS voted for their favorite pie. 51 out of 147 students staff chose cheesecake as their favorite pie. Thanks for watching and have a great day.